Disney princesses were kids one time and went to preschool. Our channel, Lalalu, will show you how to easily DIY a whole kindergarten for paper babies. Outline Princess Tiana. You can download the templates for the doll following the link in the description down below. Outline the arms up to the shoulders separately from the whole body. Now we can make them move. Do the same with the legs. Decorate the dress with polka dots. Color Tiana with pencils. Color the hair with a marker so it looks brighter. Once you are done coloring the crown, coat it with white glue and sprinkle with gold glitter. <laughs> Apply orange to the edges of the shorts to add dimension to the drawing. Our doll only has a green shirt left from the frog. Cut it out. Don't forget about the body parts. Make holes in the elbows on the main piece and the arms. Put brass fasteners into the holes. Open them up using tweezers. Press them with your fingers so they are safely secured. <laughs> now do the legs the same way. Cover the caps with acrylic paint. Tiana, you were so patient. Here's a candy for you. <laughs> Look who came to our kindergarten. This is Rapunzel. Let's trace the contours. Color the body parts beige. Add shade with a regular pencil. Make the baby's hair yellow. And the irises of her eyes green. Define strips on the shirts with a violet marker. Fill the gaps with purple. The shirt will be pink. Make the collar purple. When all the elements are colored, we can get to cutting out our paper princess. Let's fasten the arms and legs. She's so cute! Paint the sleeves blue and sprinkle with the same color of glitter. Cover brass fasteners on the knees with beige paint. <laughs> Princess Ariel is next up. Add flaps on the tail with a flipper so our princess can go back to her look without evil Ursula interfering. Color the mermaid's body. Her eyes will be aquamarine. Make the eyebrows and the hair red. Make lines lengthwise so the hair looks more realistic. Shade the top with a violet marker. Apply blue as the first layer onto the dress. Then green. Add shade on the sides with a blue marker. Coat the tail with turquoise. Trace the veins on the flipper with a blue marker. Make the shades green. Now we can cut out the mermaid. talking about? Ariel is saying that it's gonna be raining today. Tiana is saying that there's nothing to worry about as long as you have rain boots. Really? Let's pick out stylish boots for our dolls, or even better, we'll DIY them. Trace feet on patterned paper. Add flaps to the boots. Define the contours with a fine liner. Make thick lines on the soles. Cut out the shoes. 
and press the flaps at the back of the paper doll. The girls are so stylish! And the important thing is they don't need to worry that they can catch a cold! Well, what should we do with the hairstyles? Trace the outlines of the princesses on colored plastic folders. We can cut out raincoats for our dolls. Ariel, look, it suits you a lot. <laughs> now our little princesses are ready for any weather conditions. <laughs> Taking walks outside is very good for you, but you can have too much of a good thing. So let's move on to building a kindergarten for our dolls. We'll need a handmade cardboard card and red paper. Apply a glue stick to the edges of the cardboard and attach the paper. If something sticks out, you can cut it off with scissors. Do the same on the other door. Sketch out a gate on pattern paper. Cut the door in half and glue it to the wall so it can open. Outline bricks with a gray marker. Add shades and texture with the same color. Add highlights and hollows with a white gel pen. Draw and cut out a brush. Paint it green and light green with watercolors. Decorate the walls of the kindergarten with cutout flowers. A sign has to separate preschoolers from the rest. Attach a printed label to both sides of the gate. Hang a decorative lock onto the gate of the kindergarten. Use a hot glue gun so it's safely secured. Open the gate! Call trumpeters! What? The walls are bare! It looks like we opened the gate too early! Let's get to creating the interior design! Attach pattern paper to the walls. Hot glue pink foam paper to the bottom edge of the wall. Cut off the excess. Fold the sheet of blue foam paper in half. Glue a strip of foam paper to the inside. Glue a folded rectangle to the center of the outer side. We'll use it as a lock. Draw a keyhole with a fine liner. Define cuts on the door of the locker with a fine liner. Draw a few shelves inside. Attach stickers to be toys. Let's fasten the lockers to the main wall. The girls are already coming to the classes! Each princess gets her own locker! Draw a common toy case near them. A locker room is done! Draw diagonal lines on red cardboard. Trace the lines with a fine liner and create the texture of wood. Separate the side wall with vertical lines. Place the paper with wood pattern across the lines you have just drawn. Attach stickers with food onto high shelves. So high so the girls don't ruin their appetite with candy. Birds will be creating a cozy vibe and keeping watch on the cafeteria. Attach towels on a gray panel under the shelves. Cut out a printed footrest stool. Place it near the shelf with towels. Paint a view on a free spot. Coat the top with blue watercolor. Make the bottom of the sheet green. There'll be a lighthouse far away. Let's add waves. What a nice kitchen. Now the princesses won't worry about their diet. We'll only be cooking natural and healthy paper food for them. For now, there isn't anything in the left wing. Let's make a bedroom in it. A nap is very important and probably the nicest part of the day. 
Let's make sleep masks for our dolls so nothing distracts them. Measure the distance between the temples so the mask fits. Add marks on patterned paper with a fine liner and outline a mask. We can cut it out now. Our girls look so cute in these masks. Ariel, leave your tail in the locker. It won't be raining today. The rest of the girls leave their raincoats and boots to dry. Look what Rapunzel brought. That's a box of toys. Wow, there are so many things in here. Tiana was able to cook since she was a baby. That's why she decided to spoil her friends with muffins. After we are done with a snack, we can relax. We had a busy day today. The girls got tired and are ready to drift into a sweet sleep. And meanwhile, we'll come up with new doll interior designs. If you ever dreamt of going to kindergarten with princesses, <laughs> subscribe to our channel, Lalaloo, and click on the bell. This way, you won't miss any news from the Paper Kingdom.